a studio secretary murder. We're gonna murder some secretaries. No, we're gonna murder studios that secretaries, the secretaries murder the studios. Works for me. Every time, every case. Oh, Jesus The same Christ. woman gets killed over and over. And walking on the fucking track. And she's drunk, and then there's a guy with an epilepsy of death. That might be more than drunk. That might be, like, doped up. Yeah. Hey, what's up? Horse we were looking. It was. It wouldn't be easy enough to just push her on the yes, track. I'm aware that or twirl your you. mustache. Keep a hold of your hut, counselor. Now is not the time to lose your. I feel like we've been on the murder desk forever. It would appear it's the only one that didn't get cases cut for DLC. Ring, a matching engagement ring. Sound familiar? Dear Muller. Press the pawnbroker and see what you can find out. The address is 348 South Main Street. The Muller case goes before the grand jury next week, and the DA does not want any egg on his face. Then get out to the railroad depot on Santa Fe Avenue. We have another poor unfortunate found this morning beside a railroad line. Okay, he hasn't said anything cool yet. Doesn't matter, he points at them while he right, talks. Skipper, sure. And he looks scary. Oh, I, I, wish I, had, anything, I wish I had as yeah. much conviction in life towards anything as he does towards his cases. Another body. I think you should just point more. Ring. That's a starting block at the, the very least. Soon have to come to terms with the fact I've that never even seen no you clothes. point. Well, I don't know I, if you have fingers. Pointing is rude. I tend not to do it. Well, guess ass. what? If you point in a confident way, man, you'll re get respected support. like that guy. That's true. See? That's true. I'm pointing at Wooly very confident, and now he respects me. Now, like, Wooly, if you go into a, a barbecue place... That's not a joke, man. Come on. And you point at the food you want to eat, everyone yeah. will be like, Yes, sir! Yeah, yeah, for sure. Just think about notes. things that way. Not to mention the fact that, like... Where we headed? It also requires an entire lifetime of idioms and cool sayings. Oh, that, and Irishisms? Yeah, that you can only learn from growing up Irish. Public service announcement, we talked about this off-screen, but because skipping traveling like this, you don't get landmarks, which we will have to do at some point. There might be some goofy stuff incoming. Like, Very goofy. Because the game works if we drive around manually. So then I read a different thing that says it's easier if you were using fast travel because the points are... So we'll have to fucking figure it I'm out. I'm gonna go okay. manual when the time comes. You're gonna do a sick manual? Yeah. No, well, you can try- you'll try to do a sick and then, manual. And then, and uh, then, Ollie into Dark Slide. Mm. Yeah. We buy your gold! We buy okay, your gold for more on. money than anyone else! Did it come off a dead person? Is there blood Detective on it? I don't care. That's alibi. worth more! LAPD. You have a rose gold wedding and engagement ring? David Bremner. Am I gonna get something for this pledge? I think you Give were a you. character you earlier in the game. Short. He looks How very <laughs> 50 bucks? Oh Try another number. Mm. I don't like that sound. Try 10. Feel lucky you're getting it. I have the rings right here. Give me the rings. Okay, I can still move. Give me the fucking rings. Burn, burn, burn. Hmm, earrings, huh? No, oh, those are. Yep. Those are earrings. Mark Maker's mark. Usually traceable. That one came from Hartfield's Jewelry down on Broadway. How lucky. That is Thanks a good tip. jewelry store. Huh? Now you, you can track the ring. That's just uh oh. oh my god. Does this mark mean anything? Twenty two carat? All mark. Gives you an idea of the quality. Oh my god. Mmm. There's mm. literally nothing here to for that to be doing that. To. Yeah, we That's keep hearing a USB disconnecting noise. It's which very makes, unsettling. Which is literally the scariest noise anyone could ever hear if the they make videos. It goes by the name of Percy B. Shelley. Gave an address. 15 Poland Street, London, Tulare County. Can you That's a, a bunch of different of these rings? cities. Sure. <laughs> Guys, why is there a bunch of chains on top of the fucking Dark hair, computer? Sorry. What? There's a bunch of chains on top of the computer. Those. Will he put faces. a bunch of chains over there? Touch, Mr. He's trying a new look, I think. Okay. Is that a new thing? Uh, I was paying attention to the dialogue. That is my USB key. That is a part of my keychain. Oh. Is that what's making that noise? Oh. That could be it. Yeah. Let's go get that. <laughs> <laughs> no, what the shit? Wait, hold on. Give me your controller. I got this. I don't got it. What are you doing? I was trying to... Maybe it was the USB. Don't you think I would have noticed it vibrating if that's what it was? Oh, well, I forgot about that part. Guys, we're very good at this. We're extremely good at this. Hey, Willie, do me a favor and hand me that pen and paper. So we can remove this shit from existence. 
Oh, man, now my balls are cold. This is awkward. All right, USB adventures are over. We finished the USB adventure, and hopefully you heard almost none of it. Yeah. Uh, and now, unfortunately, I have cold balls. Yeah, so I missed the cutscene where Cole went to go see a lady sing? I think so. Cool. I don't, like, so this is based off my two-second memory of what happened last time. Okay. When we ran into the room so and the cutscene why, was playing. So that's why that cutscene didn't show up. Maybe. Yeah, okay. Whatever. Let's solve some murders. Oh, man. I love solving murders. We could have the local trooper check out the Tulare County address. The address is bogus. The perp is having fun with us. How? Guy's been sending the Dahlia letters. It's How do you know the perp? Okay, Again with the Dahlia. Jesus. Does this town have nothing else? No. Well, it has kitty diddlers. Well, um, diddy kiddlers? Diddy kiddlers. That's my rock name. I see. You're fucking crazy, Phelps boy. Love as soon as manual driving How happens. Eh, no. I'm getting to the to the yellow dot. Right the yeah, you know, fair enough. All that matters. We're gonna have to rely on this guy tripping up. Oh, you found a landmark. How wonderful. So did that 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 added to the to the map, right? It did. We should do a uh, random street crime. You don't mean that. <laughs> you don't mean that. You're using words that you don't mean. Why do you do that, man? I use a lot of words. Why do you just mean. lie? It was a lie. Hmm. See? See? He's bad at lying. So, will those landmarks then be things that I can, like, check, uh... On a big zoomed out map, map yeah. it'll, it'll be like, oh, that's a landmark. Oh, is that? Yeah, that's at the end. You can hit the square to get some directions. Next right. Yeah, no, I remember that. Alright, you can, yeah, so you're gonna take a really weird, awkward right here. And yeah, then, yeah. And then swing back down the yeah. pike. Those weird, awkward rights. Why are some of these invincible and others are not? Damn, it, it's up for the detective to decide. That's one of the invincible ones. They're, the 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 ones that you can break are uh, gold. Eat shit, pedestrians. No, no, no. The pedestrians are all safe. Oh yeah, I meant fellow motorists. There you go. I don't know why my brain said pedestrian. And then hook over here. No stopping. Watch out, lady! <laughs> you wanna try getting directions, Wooly? Because you're just going in weird circles here. Okay, well, let's get on the road. Stop. Turn back yeah, that's what way. I thought. Alright. Because now you're just back to the overpass entrance. Turn left from this one here. Well... A combination of Rusty and Pat will guide you. There you go. You don't need to turn. <laughs> That's not the left he meant? I guess not. Even though it's you can. Right. Through the intersection, yeah. then you're going to want to take a left, then another left, then all the way forward. Left, so left here. Left. And, uh... More big left. Uh, yeah, I see it, I see it. Mini maps are actually somewhat confusing on this one because of the overpass. The overpass. overpass. And that's the what, greatest that's, enemies. That's what fucked me up in the beginning, early yeah, on. Way in the beginning, really yeah. Because, like, I don't, knew, I don't understand how to deal with an overpass on a map. When when Willie sees an overpass in real life, his head just light lights on fire. Which sucks because all the overpasses in Montreal are all over the place, and they're also crumbling pieces of scary Watch shit. Ready. Yeah. Follow me. That one summer where they're like, make Wish sure to look up while you're driving under this overpass yeah, because be fucking good. rocks will we're crush your baby's team. skull. So I want to point out Shared that usually Matt makes know. jokes like that and their horse shit. That one's super real. That really for real happened. Why did I drive to not the crime scene? Don't like it. You, you are driving to the car, I'm saying. I guess I'm driving more. It, yeah, it was just an extra Oh drive. my god, that looked crazy. It's a woman! And she's murdered! But Heart. she's got her clothes yeah. on. I look after all the rail depots. Refreshing. I sadly... The Negro, Nelson Gaines, called it in. I came uh -huh. down here to uh -huh. make sure... The him and Negro, the look at him Jameson's over there. Around. Jameson found he the growing it up. Something like that. Look at him standing. That makes me sick. We'll talk to the corner. Standing there. I saw Being darker than us. I saw a fantastic uh, 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 comment that, is, yeah, that was like, Wooly's like, barf fire. response to all this murder is actually pretty endearing. Detective Phelps and Galloway. <laughs> yeah, it's really what? special when someone exactly proclaims happened. they we don't like murder. To the main line the when I saw okay. This man here lying on top of this woman. Oh. The woman wasn't moving and seemed to be in a bad way. 
What time was this? Hey, he looks like About a real person. That's cool. Morning. Yeah, he well, looks almost really everyone I think is a you real person. I know, but I black have, people sir. are oftentimes just you white people now. with different colored skin. In well, video games. that's pretty deep, man. For, for this game, that's uh, pretty no, deep. <laughs> Take that and uh, think about that. So that black guy wasn't a white person with black skin, he was a real person? That yeah. was a real black person. <laughs> so what, they th did a white person throw their Mario hat onto this black person and possess He's them? That and that um, made them real? Is that what you're saying? Well, the funny answer is yes. <laughs> but the truth is, is that I mean facial features. Yeah, I know. Unfortunately. This is a chit for personal items, not Ooh. booze. It's a I different camera angle. Yeah. I thought that said small shit case. <laughs> no. Two large shit cases. A, bowling a small pin. shit case. Get into the shit pit. Who fucking. Who needs a bowling pin? Yeah, a single bowling pin? That is kind of weird. And it's written on a liquor thing. <gasps> Matches. Always. Oh, my favorite. You gotta turn it around even though it's right in front of you. Yeah, you have to turn it right in the center. That's silly. It's really silly. Like, you know, coal doesn't really solve anything. Matchbooks do. That's yeah. the real partner in the case. Yeah, Rust Rusty could have exploded cases ago, but as long as matchbooks exist, murders will be solved. Oh my god, what do you got? There's definitely a pattern of opening up clutches. Keystone. Go a lot and see what they know about her. Huh. That's gonna be difficult, Cole. Why is that? Keystone Studio lot closed back in 41. Oh, well, okay. I guess Rusty was looking over his shoulder and saw the evidence he picked up. I guess up. he did. Or his drunk vision just let him know. Yeah, just zoomed in. Mm -hmm. Ooh, bitter words. I, was, uh, I am writing to apologize. You're a dirty, stupid drunk. Uh, I bet your forgiveness. God will take care of you, I'm sure. Come back to Connecticut and we can put you in a sanitarium. I'm trying to get her to come home. You know, a godly sanitarium where God will take care of you. Hey, pro tip. Sanitariums, shit shows. That's yeah. Why they, that's why they don't call them that anymore. Um, when you do something so bad that they have to change the name of the institution, <laughs> that's a problem. It's a PR move, really. So that was either mommy or daddy. It's a rebranding. Likely mommy, considering how the other cases go. Yeah. yeah. Plus it was in nice cursive hand. Pretty daughter right? leaves home, goes to the big city. What have we got here? I feel like we already did a case White exactly female, like this. Approximately four well, years we did a lot of them exactly like this. The yeah. face, but no writing, at least nothing legible. A blunt force trauma to the temple, nose, and eye regions. Ligature marks point to the probable cause of death being strangulation. Darn. Any idea of the time of death? From her temperature, after midnight would be my guess. And that liver thing they used to poke you with to figure out when you died is the coolest. Yeah, like a turkey baster Oh, thing. how do they do it? They, they take what is essentially a sharp turkey baster and jam it into your liver. Okay. And your liver has a really specific temperature when you're alive, mm -hmm. and it loses that temperature at an incredibly specific rate after you die. That's so interesting. <laughs> so you go, oh, the liver's such and such. You can. That's why you can nail it down to within one hour. It's usually. like carbon dating. Kind on of. A human being. But on a much shorter scale. And wow. grosser. Fuck Let's just poke yeah. holes into the fucking tummy until we find the liver. That's awesome. Go science. But it means that, like, at the scene, they're like... Bleh. Yeah, of course, <laughs> of course. Uh, no body, so just a head. Did you say no body? Yeah, she has no body. Smell? Very good. There is the usual evacuation smell. But the evac she's been smell. rough for quite some time. A very strong smell of alcohol. Well, the autopsy will tell, but I would assume that she was... Yeah, she got a real humdinger on the eye there. Can you be more exact about the time of death? No later than 2 a.m. The state the body was in... So, 12 to 2. Window ...is the best I can do. Huh. I don't know, I feel like an hourly time of death is pretty accurate, all things considered. Man. A lot of things can happen in an hour. All that's left to do is make a phone call. I got yeah. this gadget with guys bit, putting recording devices in the place. It's a bit nutty to imagine like... Oh, and you gotta talk to Jameson. Yeah. Okay, let me do the phone. Uh, nice photos. To, to imagine like this type of thing going down in such a frequent manner. Considering like, for example, where we live, when someone dies, you hear about it. Yeah. It's news. Did okay. you hear there was a murder? And furthermore, if it's a body found, then it's not like... 
oh, we know exactly what happened immediately? Yeah, they found a, ca a guy in the canal a few weeks ago, and it was a big deal. Is he, you know, that it, it word travels. So uh, guess what? This morning, I saw Lachine trending on Twitter, and I'm like, what the fuck now? High Speed Chase murdered the guy driving. Uh, and, and it's kind of like, kind of weird. It's like, yeah. this doesn't add up. How so. exciting. Yeah. yeah. I th but I out in the LA or the New York or the Chicago, especially. I believe, uh, I remember hearing a stat that implied that uh, murder cases tend to be in single digits per year. Yes. Okay. In our, in our, our, for our, I told you that. Yeah, okay. Because I looked it up. Right. I was like, how how lax could it be? I think how like how many uh, things are we not? Well, we didn't about? have any murders until like March of this year. Uh, talk to who? Uh, the fucking guy who found the body. The probably this jackass. Yeah, yeah, there you go. A jackass. Detective Phelps, LAPD homicide. I'm not gonna introduce John, my Ferdinand partner Jameson. anymore. We need you to answer some questions, John. If you don't mind, I prefer Ferdinand. You don't know? push your luck, knucklehead. What were you doing to the body? Ferdinand. Are you sure you won't be upset? Try me, Ferdinand. We've let child killers go away, so... <laughs> Amazing. Shut up. There's no Take law against it. Take your beating like a man. Uh, <laughs> They're not your pockets, Ferdinand. You know, there's, there's something to be said for, like, people who have a first name, middle name, last name. Yeah. As far as assassins go, they always have a three-name thing. Lipstick, Classic huh? Carmine. Lipstick, or as we call in the police force, just one large matchbook. The biggest matchbook of all. Is this yours, Ferdinand? No. I found it near her purse. I thought she could use Obstruction. Some Trust me, stop. Don't Tampering with a crime scene. Those laws weren't invented yet. Oh, they were super around. Well, Basically, these guys don't uh, really do anything purse. with them. It wasn't like she needed it. I took a look. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Look, that's 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 the pose of a necrophiliac. So apparently, someone mentioned that when you when you do the lie accusation and then so back off, their face does change. Okay, and they get more right, irritated. Well, Jameson. I know some people might find what I do unusual. Yeah, but I don't kill people. How can you prove that I killed this woman? I'm just a weirdo. Nothing. If you don't ask, you never find out. Fuck yeah. you, Jameson. Oh, wow, listing. you went... okay. What did you write on her body? What are you talking about? I didn't write anything. Oh, snap. Okay. You found the body? Yes, I did. I work here. Not much Coming longer. No. At home. Well, let's see, the railway has a lot of... Oh. Why didn't you report the body, Jameson? Do you know how this is going to look to a jury? A jury? What gives? <laughs> I, I can tell that she was dead. I came through here about midnight last night. She wasn't here then. Let me belt him again. Please do. <laughs> You're under arrest, Jameson. Whoa. We'll see how this plays out. Until then, you a goddamn a pervert. You if you were found hey, man. I'm there's a lot of creepy illegal. sex pervert shit. There it is. So, oh, great. Yeah, bring but, up your cabal yes, of weirdos. There's a lot of creepy I'll sex pervert shit. But sure, making right, it with people. dead people has got to be way up there. You know, Robert Durst got off on the basic thing that he said he found his friend's body and he, he cut it up, but he didn't kill it. Who's Robert Durst? Robert. Well, he's mentioned him a couple times already. I have no idea who it is. Oh, he's the fucking crazy serial murderer from New York. Can you drive to What's his one? murderer name? And where Robert exactly Durst. No, but everybody has a murderer name. I don't- not everyone. Okay. I mean, I, I don't know what to tell you. Because the whole time I thought he was accidentally- Because he got- it's a famous case because he got off. Yeah, I- I thought- well, this is what I thought Wooly was doing. I thought he was making the mistake and meant Fred Durst. But was saying Robert Durst. Now, and that's why I asked this time because he says, "Oh, he got off cutting up his friend's bodies." And I'm like, that doesn't sound like the man who would write Roland. No. Now you mentioned that, but guess what? For a little while, Red Durst was wearing a T-shirt that says, "I am not Robert Durst." Yeah. You should go watch The Jinx. It's a very good documentary about. Chinese want to sell the relief. Uh, <laughs> yeah. yeah. Yep. Yeah, right about that. Yep. yep. People are starving. I can't do that. They want to sell the food to fund the civil war against the communists? Really? I guess. Yeah. I, I guess hate the Russians okay, too. Says Rusty. Armies can't fight without food. You spend all your money on weapons, but you still have to. Oh, have that guy was fight. fucking lucky. Fortunately, friends were building China. Watch your mouth. You know what you're saying? 
The people of this country open for the king. You think the Chinese will balk at an emperor if they are starving? Hmm. What was happening in China at this time? No idea. I believe it was the Boxer Revolution. But my history, my Chinese history is a little fucking Yeah, rough. I'd imagine it's a little rusty. Uh, yeah, it wasn't uh, really, his really, name's Rusty. I didn't really mean it. Jokes! I, okay, sure. Jokes! Yeah, look, it's very humorous. I'm punching Matt in his arm now. I'm boning up over here. <laughs> Let's get to the liquor store, boys. And then we can finish this video. Why she buy a bunch of weird ass shit from a liquor store? Maybe she's making something. What can I do for you? LAPD, Phelps and Galloway. We're making inquiries into the murder of Evelyn Summers. Boo that Evelyn? motherfucker. She's dead? You knew Evelyn Summers, Mr. Robbins? Yes, I knew Evelyn. I was a good friend of her ex-husband. She kept some of her stuff here. Can you show us, please? Sure. Come this way. Rusty's trying really hard. So Not he's to just pull he's his gun shaking. out. He's shaking. <laughs> his hands are sweaty. He's twitching. Mom spaghetti. You, you leave him alone, you turn back, he's just licking the sides of the bottles. <laughs> Don't look at me! No, you let us the take Black Doll, we solved the Black Doll in murder! He's like Captain Knuckles without candy. He's joking, Mr. Robbins. Oh man, the investigation music just exploded the instant you came so, in here. So yeah, we gave her a creepy room. Wow. Mama wanted you home, huh? Aww. Precious man. That's a really nice fake photo. Yeah, it, it is, is. Actually. I'm surprised they didn't put just random developers on there. Like, yeah, pictures of real people on yeah. um, the dev team's family. Yeah. She wasn't always such a loner. Back in the day, she had a family, family, family. And she used to read? Evelyn was reading Aristotle. Holy shit. Evelyn wasn't stupid. She wasn't the dumb, she was just, was uh... To drink. I'm sure Rusty would say, Nabastotl? What? And she was borrowing books from Grosvenor McCaffrey. Someone never seen that name in Grosvenor. my life other than this game, obviously. <laughs> <laughs> Once upon a time, people put the names in, the, in their books. My grandfather, straight up, has his fucking name written on all his socks. Which is apparently a fucking thing from the days, back in the day. Just in case someone... I don't she get an fucking know. Where's it's just socks. There's the bowling pin. I see Evelyn hadn't held down a job for quite some time before she was killed. So you keep your nameplate? Yeah. I would keep my nameplate. Guys, can we get nameplates? I fucking wish. Where would we even put them? I don't know. On the, on the podcast table. I used to have a nameplate when I was a QA leader. Really? really? Yeah. That's cool. Did you keep it? Uh, no, it's not mine to keep. That, that sucks. Well, well no, I just it. had the nameplate. You have to slide it into the thing. You just stolen it. Oh, man. What were they gonna do? Fire you? You were leaving. Man. Bowling alleys were basically the dens of debaucherous fucks exactly back then, huh? Work in the pictures. It's where, ago. it's where, uh, cops Working used to hang out before either cheating or going home to beat on their wives. And where, like, normal guys went to I, th I thought you were gonna say, it's either where cops go to cheat on their wives, or when they're about to go home and cheat on their wives. <laughs> yeah, like, you're either cheating on them. In the drive home, I think I can get a cheat. Oh, yeah. Let's see if we don't run into the Jesus while we're out there. The Jesus? Oh come on! I don't I don't know what you're referring to. Wow. He's referring to the Jesus. Oh. Bowling alleys and the Jesus. Yeah, he's talking about fucking that overrated movie. There we go. Thank you. I'm like, it is overrated, but I'd be surprised if you don't even know what I'm talking about. She came by in the morning. A social like visit to pick up some of her things. This is what happens when you lo what, lose a stranger in the Alps. Is the fucking censored version? It's fucking nonsense. Social visit. She came out in the morning, pick up her things, a couple of books, and a quarter rye. No reason to. No reason. Doubt to, that. Yeah. To, to. Any idea where the yeah. money came from? She didn't mention it, but she did say the booze was a present for a boy. She said they had been fighting, and she had to make it up to him. I see. 
Were you and Evelyn close, Mr. Robin? How many people will be sad she's gone? I'll be one of the few. Now this guy's a pretty straight shooter. Yeah, no reason to doubt that either. I got the impression that Evelyn had been sleeping rough of late. It became difficult for me to have her stay here. Her mother was trying to get her back on the straight and narrow. She's old now. And to be honest, you have to have a good reason to want to get back on. Okay. It's, this is sad. Do you know a friend Very. of Evelyn's by the name of McCaffrey? Not personally. I can't imagine that all of it's... No, no, I was about to say, Supposedly before you press the, the button, <laughs> that I can't imagine every single one is true, but... Virginia. Thanks for your help, Mr. Robbins. No problem. Now beat him up and steal his booze. Hey, I'd like to make arrangements for the funeral. You think I could get in touch with Evelyn's mother? Put in a call to the watch commander at Central Station, Mr. Robbins. He'll be trying to reach the next of kin. Thanks. Get the guy, huh? Evelyn never hurt anybody. That was a that, very human interaction. That's probably the most sincere acting I've seen in the it whole was. game. It was. I would have loved for the camera to cut and Rusty's just on the floor slapping his own ass. Yeah, and but he's spazzing out with physics errors. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like he's just when Cole Phelps sees a sexy lady and falls down that set of stairs. Butt chugging, basically. Phelps, I've invented something new. Try it. All the kids will be doing it when it's just... <laughs> oh, like, I'm super sick of Rusty. He has good lines here and there, but I'm like, I'm ready for another. Oh, I love Rusty. He's great. Yeah, well, like, you know, too much of a great thing. Yeah. He's just and such have, a stupid fucking Neanderthal. It's we have great. nothing to talk about in this. Like, there's not even... Gonna... And all he has to do... Oh, hold will for you to discover the landmark. Okay, good. Oh shit! All he has to do is like point a gun, get some basic like. Well, he missed the, your turn. CQC. It's not this turn. Well, it you could can do be either. Oh wait, you're super right. I got fooled. Or. Learn the Miranda rights, and then uh, you're a cop. Basically. Wow, look at this fucking actual area in the sea of nothing trash like walls. It's a bar. Are we gonna find some menches in here? Oh. oh man, I got the we sneezies. Need to ask you some questions concerning sneezies. Evelyn Summers. Man, fuck you. I'm Walter Match. Evelyn Summers, what is it now? You knew Evelyn? As well as I wanted her. Ah. <laughs> She's a pain in the ass, always coming in here. A man from the tribe, drinks, I see. What is catching? Money. It's an old timey term. Probably men begging for yeah. extra yeah. drinks. I don't know. I think she was living rough. She had that kind of stunk about her. Stunk. I love this guy. I gotta use stunk. Like I said, Ask from the out. tribe. I want to emphasize that the Talk to that guy that's lit well. That what about that other guy? Who's got a face? No, the guy that's lit well. Lit oh, I remember this guy. Grosvenor McCaffrey. Mind if I ask you some questions, Mr. McCaffrey? I'm just a starving writer, detective. There's what no other type of writer. About? Evelyn Summers? And why she was found beaten it's so and strangled predictable in the rail depot on and how Fed. slimy they introduce okay. a person. I see your point. How well did you know her? I can't say that I knew her. It was more like I was aware of her. Oh, I hate him so much. Look at the face that he drew. This is that's that's what like that's that's what Phelps's internal soul sees. Yeah, Mr. McCaffrey. Nothing serious. I've had a few skirmishes. Yeah, you might want to doubt that. <laughs> that one was so sudden. Workers' rights. Mm. That kind of thing. A regular fifth columnist. Nice to meet you, comrade. Yeah. He's a goddamn red. I brought that sickle, huh? Hammer. You say you barely knew Evelyn? Yes. That is correct. That's horseshit. Da, 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 da. You're lying, McCaffrey. You look down your nose at Evelyn, but you knew her, and you have some idea. Yeah, I think of you have one happened. piece of evidence. You for sure this. do. I hope you're holding aces. Oh. I'm telling you again, I barely knew the woman. The slime. She borrowed the book from her. Yeah, yeah. the controller's slipping out of my hands. Yeah. 
Why would you lend her your book on metaphysics if you only knew her in passing? It was more than that. A Renaissance man like yourself lending his books to his acolytes. She hounded me about that goddamn book. Oh, so you lied. And she lifts it from my apartment and lies to my face that she didn't take it. As if she could even comprehend any of it. Oh, thanks for giving us a big motive. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. I saw her go into a hotel with Tiernan last night. See, he, kn he knew that, bag. like, wow, that last statement was hugely not in my favor. So I better <laughs> pin it on somebody else. Thank you for the information, else. Mr. McCaffrey. We'll be talking to you again. Mr. McCaffrey, you are under arrest for the crime of smug. And slime. Both those. The old SNS. Slimy smugness. What locations we got? Uh, he gave us, he told us a guy. Tiernan. Yeah. Nice. Captain Donnelly has new spoken poems he'll, he wants you to listen to. He wants to try them out. We'll be right there! I can't miss Captain Don Donnelly's poetry reading. Boop, boop. Beep, boop. Bom, bom, boop. Bom, boom. I want them to talk about Captain Donnelly. I don't, whenever he, Captain Donnelly's not on the scene. Everyone yeah. should be asking, where's Captain Donnelly? How come I'm not being told about righteousness and crucifixion? And, and leaking uh, gas into their lizard brains. <laughs> Like, jeez, Donnelly. Calm down. Fucking, Calm down. I understand that you love your job, but you're not like the fucking righteous sword of the Archangel Michael here. Go watch. Uh, oh. And there then you go. look down and you see a flaming sword through your chest. I, you're like, I'm sorry, Captain Donnelly. I remind you to go watch Boondock Saints. And if you've seen it, watch it again. Yeah. Right, right, right. So what was that thing that popped up there? It was a landmark. Okay. Hey, you're at the shithole central. Yeah. Oh, come on, we're gonna be late, we're gonna be late, we're gonna be late. <laughs> he's gonna Are you start. chasing that guy? He's starting. He yeah. thinks he's gonna get a No, the, the car got too close to him, so like the AI probably just freaked out and said, oh, I'm gonna die. Oh. And uh, ran off. Captain Donnelly's poetry reading, 12.24 p.m. I'd I'm go to that. It'll never stick. You'll get rid of it. I think you just go through that door too. Yeah, it was open and then it closed. That was super weird. Isn't he the cop that won the medal? I, I was. Cases? Oh. I was about to say. Yes, I am that cop. Thank you. How Arthur, much? How tired of, are you of? Uh, uh, okay, downstairs. How tired are you of video? It was game? behind you, Will. You okay. gotta fall, Rusty. Yeah, I'm thinking of moving up to a 45. How tired are we or what? Of video game versions of. Isn't he the guy that? Blah, 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 blah? I'm pretty fucking tired of it. Isn't he? Maybe that's because I'm an old man. I'm jaded and shit. But yeah, fuck. We play a lot of video games. Hey. Isn't he the student with the criminal record? Side. What's oh. he doing in the library? I mean. Okay. So the only thing about that is hey, I wish it went farther, asshole. because the like it goes it goes it's like one hey, step not far enough me. because it's like I hear the transfer student carries a knife. <laughs> he's scared, and like I want it to go What's to like I'm afraid guy? he's gonna stab Ray me. And Mal have some concerns over the Henry and Muller cases. Which I don't want aired outside of this room. The evidence is solid, Pointing. Captain. I yep. agree, Rusty. It's just that corpses keep piling up. Copycats. I've been banging the same drum. But the notes and the lipstick messages. Evelyn Summers, cartel classic Carmine. Each woman, same brand, same color. Teresa Terrelson didn't have a lipstick message. Technically, you're right, Rusty. She didn't have any lipstick. But she did have a message. We found it beneath her dress, scraped with a sharp stick. What did it say? You sure you want to know, Ray? As far as we can be sure, it said, Cunt BD. That's one way of looking at it. Looking at what? Cunt is all about access, though. You're married, so yours is mortgaged. Some of us like to pay by installments. This guy doesn't like to pay at all. Why are you so angry? Because <sighs> I just had to fire one of my assistants. He was a friend of Jameson's. God knows what he might have been up to. Oh, jeez. Oh, yeah. We have good leads in the summer schools. Yeah. But it's up to you to decide how we proceed. Keep this under your hat for now. And to follow up on Evelyn Summers, I want daily reports. 
I thought we've been solving these in a single day every time. Uh, and... Because you're a genius. And you know who fucking probably gives daily reports without being told to? Fucking Cole order. Phelps. Back to the Summers case. Get an address for McCaffrey. He'll have blown the bar. I'll meet you outside. Is, um... Did you read about the I wonder if, if Donnelly's based on a real actor. The car? Oh, they That's are the all. Cop a real person or a real actor? I survived the they're all of face, they're, face I, catcher. They're, uh, well, uh, yeah, I guess I'm wondering if like I can see a real life version of. Them. Yes, you can. Yes, yes. all of them. They I all think look every exactly single like character that. is sounding that way and, and behaving that way. Oh, behaving that way. I don't oh. know. That could just be straight up acting. Like, hey, Where just be a, the phone? a weird you, Irish guy. Where the Come fuck on, is the phone? Me. It's in there. There we go. Although the phone is white, so I don't know if it's something you can pick up and activate. I thought it was only when it was blue. I have to go through the. No, it says to keep it locked. Do I have to ask her? This I don't, is crazy. I don't think we'll you never have figure to do this a out. Thing. Damn. I don't need this. You gotta get in there somehow. That's You'll have to go around. Are... You'll have to go around. Yeah. No, no, not that way around. That oh, there's another phone. Doing? Oh, fuck it. Just use that phone. Yeah, the blue phone. That's like five blocks away, but fuck it. It's probably not hidden behind a locked door. Right. 